guys and welcome back to my channel. This is Joni from the blog SimpleLivingMama.com and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys what my fourth grader is doing for his independent homeschool curriculum this year. So most of his independent curriculum choices are coming from the Modern Amabilis Charlotte Mason based Catholic homeschool curriculum that's available for free on the internet. Um, that's where the majority of these of these choices are coming from. A few of them are things that I've decided to do for him and um, let's just jump right in and I'll tell you guys what we're going to be doing. Keep in mind a lot of these books such as The Nature Reader and these two books up here are going to be changed out term to term. This is his term one work. So he is going to be reading through the first Christians, the Acts of the Apostles for Children, the Young People's Book of Saints, and his catechism is going to be from the Faith and Life series, Jesus, Our Guide. He's going to be doing like a people and places study. And this is his book for term one, Where the Flame Trees Bloom. He's also going to be doing a geography study this semester. I think it's, I think it's term one, maybe a little bit into term two. He's going to be working through Paddle to the Sea. Okay, a lot of books I don't have actual copies of because he is going to be using them um, in my Scribd app or for free online. I mentioned in some of my previous videos that about three-fourths of my library is currently up in my attic because we just moved to a much smaller house and unfortunately I don't have room for most of my books. So some of these books are up in the attic. Can't get to them. That's okay. We're going we're gonna to work it out. Um, for math, we're using teaching textbooks. We've used it for years and it works well for our family. Um, for history, he is going to be doing a British history study using Our Island Story as well as Our Lady's Dowry. Um, he is going to be also doing an ancient history study um, um, called, using the book Famous Men of Greece and his ancient history read aloud that's going to go along with Famous Men of Greece is going to be Detectives and Togas. He's also going to be studying mythology using the children's Homer. That is a book that I definitely have upstairs in my attic. This is going to be his term one British history book, And God Bless the Irish. He's also going to have some independent literature reading. The first one that I've assigned to him is Five Children and It. He actually asked me to go back to using The Good and the Beautiful for his language arts. So that is what we have done. I got him level four. This has all been updated since the last time that we used The Good and the Beautiful. He's got his level four world biographies reader, his level four personal reader, his spelling and writing workshops book, as well as his course book. And a lot of stuff gets covered in these courses. So we've got literature, grammar usage, Grammar and usage, punctuation, art, geography, spelling, vocabulary, and writing. Yeah. Finally, he loves nature. So he is going to be reading the um, Christian Liberty Nature Readers. Um, keep in mind, he does have uh, lots of together subjects that he's going to be doing with us. I'll, I'll leave a link to that video explaining all of our together subjects as well as the science subject that he's going to be doing with the family using homeschool nature study. We're going to have just a full year of amazing nature study. So that is it for my fourth grader this year. Um, we are looking forward to a new and exciting school year. If you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.